the rain out my bedroom window that night. Disgruntled clothes I hadn't worn in days. All my necessaries for my never ending list of hobbies. Take me on a journey that I won't forget. Take me forward. If I could stop time in this place just for a second more, I would. In the place I spent my life, in the place that grew me. My name is Daniel Page, I'm an amateur filmmaker and photographer and whilst I was moving out of my parents house last month I made a short one minute film. The film went viral and I found myself in a sort of run down apartment in the suburbs of the city but in a luxury social housing flat by the river. I made the money to pay for everything by selling the rights of the short to a large production company overseas. However. Soon enough I realised that this wasn't going to be as easy as I first thought. How can I afford this? This is too much. I've made a mistake. I still haven't got a job. My savings are slowly drying up. Why did I refuse to listen? Father, why did you make me dive in? Yes. No. No. It was my choice. I wanted to throw myself in because I'd never done it before. It may have seemed stupid, but I wanted to. I wonder sometimes who I could have been if I hadn't left my parents in such a hurry. I didn't wait for their response. I just left. <laughs> But now, now I feel so alone. What if it wasn't father? But it must have been. What if he wanted you to use this as an experience? To do what? To learn more. 
about what it is to be human. To find love. What would he want you to be doing right now? He'd want me to look for someone. Someone that I could share my life with. You hold yourself up in your head for too long and you may find yourself at the crossroads of consequences that are only the fault of yourself. But what if no one wants me? What if they know I'll fly away and leave them? How could they know? I don't know. Then find out. I met this guy. He seemed shy at first, but I think he was just a little lost. It seemed like he just needed someone to talk to. He found a lot more stability, and he opened up more the more we spent time with each other. Before long, we were dating, and it was like he was a completely different person. It was almost a shame. He seemed in pieces before we began dating, and I wanted to see deeper into that desperate side of him. How selfish I was! But he made a lot of effort for me, and he knew I made even more for him too. The way he was genuine with me. I never felt that kind of trust. It wasn't long before I'd made my decision. I loved being with him. And he loved being with me too. I love you.